Let's get to your new move. Um, you bought a disastrous stock yesterday, <laughs> New today, York Community today, today, Bank. Today, yeah. New York Community Bank. Why'd you buy this? Yeah, so I don't know. Uh, if you, <laughs> it's <laughs> a trade. <laughs> so, all right, so let me say two things. I'm not calling a bottom in the stock. Please don't follow me into it. It's a trade. Uh, we're not getting. Ma I'm not getting married. We're we're hooking up. Okay. Uh, look. If you, if you know anything about this business, you know the Bible, the number one rule of picking stocks, you never, ever, ever invest in a company that's based on Long Island. You could just assume it's either an outright <laughs> scam or it's people that have no idea what they're doing, ineptitude. And this is- Your in, home, for those who don't know. I'm from Long I could right, say that. You, you, say can't, you can't say that. Right. You definitely can't That's say why that, I Jersey. I prefaced it with that. So Long Island-based company, biggest red flag. It's like meeting somebody who says they, they you know, so, all right, but like put that aside because it's a trade. This is what I would say on New York Community Bank. I listen to the call. I don't know any more than anyone else does. All I can tell you is it sounds like they did the signature deal. They got in way over their head. They bit off more than they could chew. They also did Flagstar. So they got involved with two acquisitions. They're not accustomed to being a $100 billion uh, bank. They're not, like, mentally. They don't know what they're doing yet. And this is the quarter where basically they came out and admitted it. So it seems like this is not some systemic issue. It could change. Uh, JP Morgan reiterated they still think the stock should trade to 11 bucks, um, and, and they're sticking with it. So I just looked at it. I said, I know nothing more than the market about this situation other than I like to buy panics. Here's what's different for me versus a fund manager looking at this. I could get out today. If I end up being wrong, I get out tomorrow. If you are doing this with other people's money in a fund, you have to explain yourself why you were taking a shot on this to shareholders. So I don't think institutions want to do that, hence the panic. The stock is down huge yesterday, another big down day today. So early this morning when the market opened, I said, you know what? I'm willing to bet there's a little bit more panic than there needs to be here, and I'm willing to bet it's still down because there are people that can't admit they own it and they want to get out of it. And uh, I like that setup. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. This is not an endorsement for New York Community Bank. This is just me taking a shot where I see a lot of other people panicking. Okay. So let's get then a, a little bit more on the, on the kinds of opportunities that might make sense in the here and now. Josh sees a, a disaster, says, "Hey, I, I'm going to take a shot." For a trade, KRE. Yeah. Wait, wait, hold on. The whole KRE down six percent yesterday, five percent today. That's the worst two-day stretch since the bank mini banking panic, March and uh, 9th, 10th, and, and 13th earlier uh, last year. So this is like a pretty momentous two-day period for all these names.